So what I want to show you today um, is this baby here, um, Infiniverse. So if you are interested in um, real estate in the metaverse, if you're in South Africa, there's been a bit of a buzz, oh, not really much of a buzz, but kind of, where companies are buying real estate um, in the metaverse. So I'm going to show you guys, I don't have an apartment in the metaverse as yet honestly speaking i haven't really thought about doing it but perhaps i should um it wouldn't hurt really because at the moment it really isn't expensive see um i want to show you how fortune city looks like so let's do that let's go into fortune city okay as we wait for it to load as you can see there's central city cherry springs cyber city beast city mega star city alliance city yeah okay so now i'm in um fortune city so let's wait for the environment to load and then i'll talk to it And there she is. So the city of gold, if you are from Johannesburg, South Africa, you know what I'm talking about when I say the city of gold. So this is it. Think of this as our Johannesburg, the city of gold. Um, yeah, so these are all the buildings. I will not, I'll, I'll, I'll be moving around to show you really. But as you can see in this building here, right? All those, all those circles with different people those are people that have bought real estate in the metaverse um and then this one you can see as well so high so oh and i'm seeing a, a sign of mcdonald's i wonder if it's really mcdonald's or if it's just someone with the um a sign of it um but yeah so let's move around i want to show you guys um maybe let's start actually on this building show you guys what you need to do if you want to buy uh, an apartment so again you always have tourist information info and if you want to buy see if there's anyone who's selling or there's an empty apartment or even go and view one of the apartments here you just have to teleport into or well, click on on that rather and then here you see um, everybody that has um, an apartment here will be uh, listed um, and then here is basically the price of this first one, one one, Wahoo Street for sale by Bioshock. Um, it's a penthouse and it costs fifty thousand meta coins. I only have five hundred, <laughs> so obviously I can't afford this, you know. Um, so yeah, so you can buy, you can make an offer, you can visit the floor, and you can go back. So perhaps to show you guys, um, maybe let's start with make an offer. There you go and then you can just set your price there you know um offer it down or whatever oh okay my power is low and yeah but we're obviously not going to make an offer you can then uh visit the floor okay so let's wait for this apartment to load All right, so this is how the apartment looks. Okay. Still. Okay, I see it was still loading. But yeah, guys, this is an, a typical apartment. Well, this is obviously a penthouse, not a typical apartment. <laughs> but yeah, so one thing I've picked up with these apartments is that um the size is the same from what i've seen so far the differences would be you know the kind of um tv stand that you have is it wood is it white um the couch as well the couch will generally just change the um, the color and the material the floors i think i've seen two types of floors so far but the layout itself it's usually just like this um it doesn't really change much so yeah let's walk let's go outside so i can show you what you can see when you're outside so there you go you've got this 
beautiful balcony on the penthouse with a nice pool and obviously we can't swim inside it but um yeah and then you've got these beautiful views hold on let me go a bit up there you go then you've got these beautiful views and there is the the, the, the the lady that owns this gold city obviously um then you can see all of the buildings the ones are close to you um and yeah guys this is pretty much oh this is a very tall skyscraper but yeah guys so this is pretty much what up like apartments in the metaverse look like so if you're interested in buying really um yeah why not uh we don't know where this thing is gonna go like how far things are gonna go really um so i'm assuming that um at some point this will become a natural business you know and yeah so if you want to check how much you have as you can if you go to your po your profile you can then go to meta coins what to do Sorry guys, something is not working properly right now. Can... Apologies for that. Yeah, so this is, um, yeah, this is after me going to MetaCoins. So as you can see, I only have 500 and I'm able to basically buy um, from uh, 19, 99 cents, uh, get, getting me 100 MetaCoins to almost a thousand dollars which gets me a hundred thousand meta coins so let me then show you then how much a typical um maybe like a, a cheaper apartment would look would how much you would pay rather for a cheaper apartment so going back to this building obviously this is one of it's a very popular one um i can scroll down okay let's leave it to to load Okay, so I can scroll down and as you can see, there's, there's other ones that says for sale, right? For sale. So if you click on it, you can then see, okay, it's on floor number 14. It's going for 5.5, uh, 5.6 <laughs> uh, meta coins. And if you want to see how much, if you, if you want, he's, okay, let me just go to these guys, right? Um, yeah, so it's as you can see, it's not for sale, right? It says occupied, but then you can make him an offer. So meaning, you know, um, starting from 5.5 for 5.6, you can make him an offer if you want to buy his space. So let's say the building was fully occupied and there were, there were no for sale uh, signs like we have here, then you can just approach any one of these people and make an offer. So this is why I'm saying that perhaps in the future, this might then become, you know, like so much become quite valuable. I I do see it becoming valuable actually. Let me, not say, let me not say perhaps in the future. But yeah, guys, I think my battery is misbehaving right now. Let me just walk around and show you rather let's teleport this ish. Um, uh hopefully i can still remember how i got to there's a nice place i got to with the dragon um as you can see everywhere you see circles you no know, those are those are people's those are people who have bought apartments everywhere you see a circle is someone has bought an apartment oh do i even remember how to get to the dragon I think I'm lost. I don't think I went. I think I was going more to the north than. Oh gosh, guys, I'm so freaking lost. I don't remember. I'm still learning this place. It was such a nice place like you've got such a beautiful view there and um the apartments were quite expensive not as high as that the one that we first landed on because 
um that one obviously the, the the building is quite tall so you expect to pay more because then you've got better views there guys i think this this should be it for today's video um yeah check it out you know if you really want to um you know experience you know the metaverse and how it's going to evolve over time because obviously everything improves over time at some point i'm sure it's going to be one of those where people are walking around um in proper avatars <laughs> and we're engaging as if we're engaging in real life you know um perhaps before my battery dies let me show you um how let me show you how how to actually speak to a person hopefully we'll find someone there guys please buy these head headsets um it is so freaking lonely here but then again i don't see really interesting events that are happening um hence i'm not seeing a lot of people even earlier on today when i came here it was quite dead um perhaps i'll do a video on how to engage with the person and i will oh, i don't know what are the rules about videotaping a conversation with the person who hasn't you know um accepted you know or what's the word i'm looking for given permission but guys this is it oh Okay, that's Kevin. Obviously, he doesn't want to talk to me, but yeah. Thanks, guys. Look, my battery is so freaking low. 5%. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. Until the next time, have a good day.